Oh, hey, party people, just being a hacker. Um, okay, so <laughs> today uh, today we got uh, something uh, called Iberico, I Iberico, Iberico, Iberico uh, ham, uh, or like a cured pork, uh, something like that. That's what it's called. And so why I got this is because I was watching a thing on the internet and they just looked delicious. Now, normally uh, animals don't look delicious to me. I just... Um, like I just eat them because they are delicious, but this one looked delicious. So I was like, I actively seeked to try and find this one to try and get it, eat it because it looked awesome. And the, it, and also it also fits into my diet, which is like, um, it's, I'm, I'm trying to eat only specific things. Like it, it supposedly has no preservatives. Or it only is salted. So then that's within my, the range of what I can, what I can eat. And then also we have today something called peeled black garlic so i was another internet thing i maybe i'm spending too much time on the internet but another internet thing where uh this is cooked for i think 30 days or something like that on a really low heat now you, you can correct me if i'm wrong maybe two weeks to 30 days i know it's a long freaking time longer than usual so uh yeah I, and, and again it, it has nothing in it as well so it's an it's one it's just that's just a pure a pure product so uh yeah, we're going to, but Ch Tammy's going to try it first today. So, uh, definitely. I, and I just want to, um, make a note that both of these products we found at the Italian center. So if any of you want to try it out, you can also find it yourself. So I think I'm going to try the pork first, the Iberico pork. Um, you said it, it's aged for like 24 to 36 months. Year and a half. Yeah. So... Oh, wait time. a minute, 24, that's two and a half years. Yeah, so it's, and it even says on there, it says 24 to 36 months right on the Three package. years, so, that's three years. Yeah, it's aged. So there's like a whole story on how how the process starts from when they're weaned off their mothers. They're, they're adults when they're slaughtered, not babies. So we're not that mean. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see here. What does it look like? So they say that a good quality Iberico ham, or they call it jamon Iberico, a good quality has lots of marbling in it, which looks like it does. So I'm just going to pick up a piece here. We asked them to cut it really thin. <clears throat> oh, and we don't normally eat pork, just usually on special occasions, um, but this might be an exception. Mm. Mm. It's only like slightly salted. It's not, it's not really strong. There's not really... You know how pork sometimes has that really kind of a, I don't even know how to explain the flavor of it, but sometimes pork has a, a, a distinct flavor to it that I personally don't like, and this doesn't have it. Not at all. Do you want to try it, Billy? Mm -hmm. All right, let's try these little stragglers over here. Yeah, it doesn't smell like anything. Like typical, typical, it's interesting that this just came to me because I didn't, like obviously processed meat is not something that I can have in my thing because it's it's a complex ingredient. Anything that's not, anything that's a simple ingredient, that's about as, like I could have a handful of sugar if I wanted to, it, it wouldn't matter like what, what I did. So I always try and I can, I allow myself one thing, like if I won't have something, I can have put butter on it or something like that or oil, something can be cooked in oil, but that's about it. So I was interested because it was, it's just pork and salt. And uh, so... It tastes a little bit, but it's not, it's not offensive. Like it's not like, not like really strong. Like what Tammy said, it's, it's good. Like I could, I could eat that. Normally I can't eat a piece of processed meat by itself because it's, it's disgusting. So this is actually pretty good, but uh, yeah, it's cool. Aftertaste too is like, uh, it's, it's light. It's not as bad as like some, like usually I taste when I eat meat like this, I taste barn. I can taste the barn that it's been in. Like, yeah, I don't know, but I taste weird. So let's try the, you want to try this, uh, Tammy? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Here, I'll give that to you. You can. Okay. 
So this now is peeled black garlic. Hmm, it smells like, it smells like barbecue. Hmm. <laughs> this is the little one. Hmm. That's what it looks like. It almost, it looks like black licorice. It's sweet. Sweet. Kind of has a, wow. Like sweet garlic. <laughs> but they don't put anything in it. There's, yeah, it's just like roasted. But it's it's got like a, a hint, like in the very beginning, and almost a hint of black licorice, kind of. Hmm. Which is interesting. But then, but then it's like sweet garlic. I like it. It's like candy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Let's give it a try. It looks like a, a black licorice, definitely 100%, even has the same texture. It even smells like it a little bit. Interesting. Uh -huh. Like those black candies that you, uh, I wonder if that's the origination of the black candies, you know, those licorice candies, those, because uh, this, this almost seems like it. Yeah, yeah. Who came up with cooking garlic for a month, though? Like, that's just, that's know, insane. Someone just forgot it in the oven for a month. <laughs> yeah, it tastes a lot like them. I get those, those candies would, um, I, my guess would be those candies are the imitation of what this is. Because mm -hmm. this tastes more, like obviously, they, like I said, this is natural, and but they taste almost like those candies. Like these taste like fresh, fresh candies because it's yeah. like super soft and chewy. And... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So interesting. Very interesting. I like them. So um, out of the two of them, I think I'm going to go with this one. This is my favorite. Probably buy that again. Uh-huh. I yeah. think so. What do you What do you say? Yeah, it was about thirteen bucks, I think, for that bag. Yeah. And the other ones were cheaper, but they were. Um, you had to peel them. You had to peel them, so that's all peeled and all ready to go. So I think that's a better, a better buy. Yummy little snack. It's definitely good. I like it. Cool. Yeah. So that's kind of a, a W. 